Armand Wiggins posted a video talking about how Nicki Minaj needs to drop her album after Cardi B drops her album so that Nicki Minaj numbers can be higher than Cardi B, but I disagree. They need to drop on the same day on some 50 Cent and Kanye West shit. Cardi B fans are always saying Nicki Minaj waiting on Cardi B to drop, Nicki Minaj waiting on Cardi B to drop. You motherfucking right. I'll be waiting on you to drop. Why wouldn't I? I found out last week that nobody really bought Cardi B album. It was streamed a lot. And you want to know why it was streamed a lot? Because streaming one Cardi B song 1,500 times equals one unit sold, one album sold. In what fucking world does streaming one song 1,500 times equals one album unit sold? Why are they always changing the goalposts? No, they need to drop on the same day so that whatever rules apply to Cardi B, they apply to Nicki Minaj as well. Imagine going to work and you turn in your work assignment and they penalize you and they dock your pay. But then your coworker turn in their work assignment. It's cool, everything is fine. They get shortcuts, they get rewarded. No, drop on the same day. Fuck that. Why, why change the goalposts? You wanna know why they change the goalposts? Because Nicki is winning. The rap girl is there here. And this is being generous. You know what? They're here. Nikki's up here. You see how she's not even in the camera anymore? Yeah. That's why. They want they want Nicki Minaj to look like she's not popular anymore because, oh, this album is doing better than this album because y'all are manipulating the numbers. It's going to look like that. Nicki Minaj and Cardi B needs to drop on the same day. Atlantic Records, they need to go ahead, take their L, and move on with their life. It's going gonna, it's gonna to generate a lot of money for both parties. At least Atlantic Records will get a little bit of their money back if they decide to drop on the same day. Let me know what y'all think in the comments.